Hi, it's a beautiful day to craft. We will make this backpack gift box. It is great for school craft projects or teachers' gifts. The mini envelope at the front fits a gift card. The download link is in the description. There are two Studio 3 files for Camel, two SVG files for Quicker. Upload the backpack SVG file to Design Space. Here are all the elements. The first things we're gonna do is right click and ungroup. I have grouped all school lines with their paired elements. On the right hand side here are all the decorative panels. They are in one group and we don't need to do anything here. Move away the two buckles here. This is the front panel of the backpack. The biggest piece is for the backpack. Click on it. On the right hand side, it shows the backpack has been selected. The top layer is the folding line. Click the line layer. Go to the top left and change it to school. Click on the top to select this group. Both layers are selected. Click attach. Next is the side pocket. Click on it. Change the top layer to school. The line has been changed. Click the pocket. Both layers are selected. Click Attach. We will need two side pockets. Right click and duplicate. Move on to the gift card envelope. Same here, change the top layer to school. Once it's done, attach two elements together. There are two straps here. The shorter one is the top strap. The longer one is the back strap. Change the line to score. Attach the group. Right click to duplicate one more strap. Click the top strap and change the line to score. Click the strap to select and click attach. We have done all the score lines. Click continue to cut. This pop-up window is new. I'm gonna choose unmatch. Here are the cutting layouts. Come to the material page. The first page doesn't need scoring tool. Therefore, we can't edit the tool yet. I would just install the score stylus first so I don't need to worry about it later. The first page is done. Once unload the material, the tool section is available to edit. Choose your tool here. I'm using the stylus. Continue to cut the rest. Here are all the cutouts. Six decorative panels, two side pockets, one mini envelope for a gift card, the biggest piece is the backpack. Front panel for the backpack. Two back straps. One strap for the top. Two buckles. Grab the backpack piece and a pen. We will curl this section here. Same the other side. Curl this section. Fold this tab here backward. Fold all the score lines. Once it's done, put the piece aside. 
grab the two pockets and the two side decorative panels. Fold the pockets. Glue the bottom two small tabs. Glue the pocket at about a quarter inch from the bottom of the side panel. Hide the two side glue tabs behind the panel. This way the pocket structure is stronger. Put glue at the back of the tabs. Put it on a flat surface, use a ruler to secure. The side panel should look like this. Repeat to make the other side panel. The two side panels will go to the side of the backpack. Before glue, curl the top 3 quarter inch of the decorative side panels. Attach them to the backpack. Glue the front decorative panel on. When apply glue, avoid any glue on the tab. Use the panel to cover the tab. Make sure the tab is not glued. Now for the rectangle panel and the top strap. Fold the two ends of the strap. Curl the middle part. Pull the straps through the cut lines. Secure the tabs at the back. Glue to the top of the backpack. The backpack should look like this. Glue the bottom two tabs with the sides. Hold till the glue is set. Apply glue here and stick them together like this. This part will be a bit tricky. Take time and hold together till glue is dry before moving on to next step. Ensure the glue tabs align the curve here. Same the other side. Fold the mini envelope. The side with the straight ends is the bottom of the envelope. Glue the bottom with the sides. You could make the envelope after gluing the front panel of the backpack. I don't know why I did the envelope first. Anyway, Attach the front panel to the backpack. The top curved parts are tricky. I find it's easier to send the box up and hold the sides till the glue is set. Glue the front decorative panel on. The back curve is loose again. I didn't wait till the glue is dry, so just gonna fix it again. Next is to glue the envelope at the front. The back of the envelope is a gap to insert the front tab. Before that, glue the buckles. 
Not sure if you could see, there are four score marks for position the buckles. Glue the buckles. The tab will be hidden behind the envelope. When apply glue, put it around the envelope, but not at the top. No glue in the middle. Pull the tab down. Make sure the envelope is not covered the buckles. The last three pieces are the back decorative panel and two back straps. Fold the tabs upward. Curl between the tabs. Pull the tabs through the cut lines. You can leave the back straps like this. I'm going to glue the top of the straps to make them look like this. It just looks nicer. Put glue at the top about a half inch. Secure the tabs at the back. Glue the back panel on. Gently press to secure. The backpack is done. For the next part, we will need a quick cut drawing pen. Here I used 0.4 tip black. Upload the accessories SVG file to design space. We can see a crayon here. The black rectangle is part of the ruler where we will change to draw. Right click to ungroup. Click on the ruler. Go to the right hand side panel. Click the black rectangle. Go to the top and choose pen. The default setting is 0.4 black. It's a pen I'm using. Click the ruler again. Both layers are selected. Click attach. I'm gonna to do the crayons first. Click the eye icon to hide the ruler. I'm going to make three crayons. Select the crayon, right click and duplicate. Change the crayon to green. I'm gonna change the B to green too. Duplicate one more crayon and make it orange. Same as the C. You could make as many crayons as you like. It's a chance to use scrap cards you have handy. Here are the crayon cutouts. Glue the black parts on each crayon. Now the crayons are done, move on to the ruler. Select all the elements, right click and group. Tick off the eye icon on the right hand side to hide them. Turn the ruler back on. Click make it. Choose your material. Insert the pen in clamp A and cut. We have the ruler. After cutting the ruler, unload the pen and close the lid so it doesn't dry out. Glue the ABC letters at the front, the crayons and the ruler in the side pocket. I think it might be a good idea to use foam dots to glue the crayons and the ruler. It will add nice touch to the accessories. This cute backpack gift box is done. Hope you enjoyed the project. Thank you for watching.